students welcome to the module 3 of the subject applications of computer in pharmacy so this is unit 3 and this particular chapter whose title is applications of computer in pharmacy we shall be studying the following content first we shall talk about the drug information storage and retrieval followed by pharmacokinetics drug design, mathematical modeling in drug design, under computational approaches, we have to study about the hospital and clinical pharmacy, the electronic prescribing and discharge system, the barcode medicine identification system, the automated dispensing of the drugs, the mobile technology, adherence monitoring, the diagnostic system, followed by patient monitoring system and the importance of all such functions in pharmacy. So before moving in detail, so, so far we have uh, learned about what drug information is, how the pharmacy professionals are interconnected and what are the different sources of information where we discussed about World Wide Web and Internet as the main resource. So, here in this particular video, we shall be discussing about the international data banks for retrieval of medical information. First one is Excepta Medica. It is an information system which provides nearly 25 lakh abstracts in database and it covers 4000 biomedical journals. The system actually was computerized way back in 1968 and uh, you'll be surprised to note that more than 2,50,000 records are added to this database on yearly basis. So this experta Excepta Medica is information retrieval service. It provides the descriptive indices of biomedical and clinical literature. And it started in uh, 1946. And it was an independent, not-for-profit foundation. It got its support from US and Netherlands government. And uh, since 1967, you'll be surprised to note that 2 million records have been entered to this database. And this database is vended through Dialog, D-I-A-L-O-G, a user fee database. And the Excepta Medica charge Dialog a reality each time any customer of Dialog customer uh, access this Excepta Medica. Okay. So, this Excepta Medica record were entered since 1975 and is responsible for setting users' fees. Moving to the next one that is Medlar. Medlar stands for Medical Literature Analysis and Retrieval System. I repeat, Medical literature analysis and retrieval system as the name says it is computer computer based retrieval service and it is offered by national library of medicines like uh, excepta medica it this database also contains 25 lakh articles books journals thesis audiovisual and microfilm material it do not actually contain only abstracts but the complete information and the system locates medical and scientific article. The key feature in this is that not only by keywords and content, it can retrieve the information by author also. There are some specialist subdivisions like Toxlin, Cancer Line and Chem Line in this database. And in 1971, a fast working system was developed, which is called Medline or uh, Medlars Online. Okay. 
so this was about extrapta medica and uh, medlar the another one is ama net drug information database it was uh, actually a collaborative effort of gte telenet medical information network and american medical association they together included and collaborated to produce standard dosage its action interaction information on special patient case and it gives information for more than 1500 drugs so this ama or net disease information base it contains description and diagnostic symptoms for more than 3500 like 3500 diseases so this was about uh, ama or net system another one is uh, bitnet and limbs bitnet is a worldwide network of universities and research institutions and they exchange files which include uh, data drafts of paper messages reports memoranda all these in the case of bitnet if I describe this LIMS system, LIMS uh, keep track of information about all the sample in lab and project which either have been completed or are in progress. So the full form of LIMS is Laboratory Information Management System. Another one is International Pharmaceutical Abstract Database. This database is produced by American Society of Hospital Pharmacists and it contains more than 6,000 publications since 1970. BioSys is a database which contain biological abstract which are produced by Bioscience Information Services. So all dialogue database they are completely online unlike NLM or BRS dialogue does not put any uh, year earlier year of database into back files for offline processing. Dialog puts them to back files uh, for online processing. So that is the main feature. Okay. These are a few books that I have referred for preparing this content for you. Thank you for your patient listening.